Hello YouTube, Lavers239 here, and today we are playing a Universal Time. But more specifically, we're going over the Shadow of the World. Alright, so basically, two things I should point out. So it has its passives, regenerates two health every second. And some most moves regenerate your health. But there's also this new bar, maxes out at 10, and some moves require it to be used. I'll show you that later. There's also, see, well, I'll get to that later. First is click. Just a simple punch. As you can see it raises the bar. It's also the Not too great of a hitbox. It can hit sometimes, but not too fun. Next is E. It just knocks the opponent away. Since this dummy doesn't take Knockback, you'll just have to do it. It's also extremely spam. Spam. This is just me. Next is R. It doesn't send it anywhere. It is also extremely spam. And with E, this is just R. Alright. T is knives. I'm not really sure how this move works, but the first time you press T, you get five knives in each hand. Then you throw them. But, okay. You can throw them for every set of knives you have, and after that you will have to do them. Right now they don't actually have hitboxes. I don't know, it's weird. Alright, no Y, there's an F, which is time shock, and we just peel from the other Next is G, just a shadow uppercut. Basically, a bizarre day you shadow the world E. And the only other move on Crouch Mode app is it's just the counter. Are you really trying to shoot? Anyone who hits you, even with a projectile, you teleport behind them and slow them down. I'll just get rid of that. Now, the really, well, like every Shadow of the World ever, there's stand mode on and off, but now it's called crouch mode. You move very slowly, but the moves are different. Click. Yep, it's slower. Also has the aerial version, but this one isn't too good either. If you're landing with it, you can hit it a lot easier. E, it knocks some. It's like the same thing as crouch mode off, except instead of away, it knocks some very far up. R, it's the same thing as this. Keeps them in place. Which is why both R, E, with crouch mode on and off work. But you can do this. I'm not sure how this would actually work. Ultimate between both eyes. Anyways, T Space Ripper Stingy Eyes. Yep, it costs a meter to use up. You can also hold it. Half a meter, actually. Alright, C mode F is also. Yep. G is Shadow Combo. As you can see, very special. All the moves on Shadow World barely have any to them. This does insane damage. It is very good. The only other move is B. Oh. Unless you count Time Stop. Not B, B plus. <laughs> This thing is I don't know many people. I'm not that good. The reward just came out, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you found it useful. As you can see. My thoughts on the new show of the it's very good. Basically, no cool things. I tried to project out on some people I don't think they were. Something. 
but time stop is very good since it can last up to 10 seconds. No one I'm not even sure if time stop has a cooldown either. No, it does not. Well, it does. And yeah, that's it for the video. I hope you guys enjoy. If you want to see more stuff like this in the future, just let me know. I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.